says that his friend has fornicate has committed adultery he did not fornicate he's married so he committed adultery he cheated on his wife and now he's back with his wife repenting and wanting to know which place on or how can he get the punishment of stoning to death to cleanse his sin first of all Achie, this punishment and the likes cannot be carried out by individuals not by the individual himself who committed the sin it cannot be carried out but by, by the community uh, um, the muslim community or the head of the muslim uh, islamic center this prescribed punishment whether it's beheading execution or flogging or stoning or chopping off the hands of a thief can only be executed by the Muslim ruler of the country. So it's not the head of the community or the uh, imam of the city. It has to be executed by a Muslim ruler who has the army and the uh, uh, armed forces and the police force under his control. He's the authority that only can carry this prescribed punishment in Islam. So for you, my friend, you don't have the right or your friend has, does not have the right to ask others to stone him to death. And if he does, then he would be committing suicide. Those who stoned him would be murderers and must be punished according to Islamic law. So what to do, Sheikh? Akhi, Allah... One of his beautiful names is As-Sittir, the one who conceals. So if Allah concealed your sin, it is a sin for you to go and tell others about it. It's a sin to go to your wife and say, listen, hun, when we were uh, uh, separated, I did this and this and this. Totally haram, totally sinful. And it's sinful for you to go and expose it to others. So what's between you and Allah remains between you and Allah. Ask Allah for forgiveness and Allah would erase your sins.